So while baseball fans here in the city of Buffalo won't be able to watch the Bisons in person to start the season, they will, however, be able to take in some major league action and the Toronto Blue Jays at Salem Field. Channel 2's Dave McKinley is live at Salem Field tonight with the latest on what fans can expect with the return of the majors in downtown. Hey there, Dave. Well, at this point, under current state guidelines, it would allow for about 20% of the stadium to be occupied for this particular stadium. That would be about 3,000 fans. It is expected, well, if it happened right now anyway, remember they would need either proof of a negative COVID test or proof of being fully vaccinated. But that is for right now. And there won't be any baseball here until at least June. And by that time, should the pandemic wane further, we could be talking about more fans than that. Bison's officials say having the Jays here last year without fans was an honor. Having them here this year with folks actually getting a chance to come in and see Major League Baseball is just icing on the cake and could make for lifetime memories. It'll be certainly a, a very hot ticket um, if we're able to do it and when we're able to do it. Um, but I think any, it'll be a memorable thing for any kids, any adults that, um, Hey, I remember that year when, when we actually got to go see major league baseball there, it'll be a, a really time stamp, um, uh, enjoyable moment that hopefully we can share with everybody. Of their seasonal employees as well. Of course, there we're talking about the ticket takers, the ushers, those who hawk the concessions, your cone heads and such, all of whom are a big part of the actual live game day experience and all of whom the buys and say they missed just as much as the fans. In downtown Buffalo, Dave McKinley, Channel 2 News.